Alrighty, episode 12. Alright, let's go right into it. Nenji Ogata, new best boy. Not as good as Amiguchi, but like number two. I guess when you put it like that, maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. Still, though. Uh, hey, are you even listening? What the hell just happened? Huh? Shit, the, the train. It just went off the rails and... I didn't know you could sleep standing up. No, this is... The same platform as Okay, before. what the fuck? Do you have like... Hell is this? Feature vision? We were in that train car and... Then the whole thing got knocked off the line. So, how are we here? No way we would have walked away from an accident like that. Kisaragi, weren't you on that train too? How did we get back here? You mean the train I'm about to get on? You're... about to? Look, just... I need you to listen to me, okay? Uh, whoa, what are you getting so serious about? I'm saying, I've been on this platform before. Well, duh. This is how you get to school every day. No, I mean, just now. I was here. <sighs> uh, is this, like, a setup for a joke? No, wait. I remember. It wasn't even my train. I got on the semi-express to go after you, Kisaragi. You and I were together the whole time, right? Uh, I think I'd know if we were together. Not what I meant, but okay. You're being weirder than usual. Are you okay, man? It's the same station. <sighs> wow, this story already started me off with some <laughs> weird mindfuck shit. Should have figured you assholes would still be here. Well, look what we got here. Logata, most punchable face in the city. You guys need some new material. The hell are you trying to say to me? I think it's about time we settled our shit. <sighs> we already did. I beat your ass into the ground. I guess that didn't count either. Crawled up your ass anyway. Heard you were talking shit on the Kuri High Gang, saying all we got is strength in numbers. News to me. No more running. We settle this right here, right now. No more run. We settle this. I'm running. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> what? what? The heck's going on? Cut that out. I'm Relax. trying to run. I'm not gonna do the same fight twice. I don't have time for that shit anyway. What do we got here? Don't tell me this little bitch is your girl. Hey, whoa. <laughs> Didn't know you were into elementary schoolers. <laughs> oh, got her. Stop, man. The hell did you just say? You want to say that again? Say it to my face. Come on. <laughs> Isn't Ogata like hella weak? Hey, stop it. Holy shit. Wait, didn't he get fucked up that one time? Man, not again. Damn it. Hey, listen. Well, that's my train. Bye, or whatever. Hey, wait! You can't get on that. You're gonna regret it. You're being super weird right now. Look, shut up and listen. Uh -oh. You can't get on that. I can't, huh? So you can just decide. It's not like, like you can just tell me what to do. I'm so done with you. Wait! No! God damn, it's just like before. Okay, let's see if this is gonna be some like future vision shit. 4 12 p I mean 5 12 p.m. Why? Why are you here? This isn't even your train, right? So I'm worried about you, silly. So Kisaragi always gets on that train, and the train always crashes. Once she's on. She's basically dead. How the hell can I make her understand? You're not listening to me, damn it! Because you're not making any sense. What, you just wanted to have the last word? Wait, that's it. This is the same thing as before. You got all mad at me, so I went after you. So, when was this? 
in my dreams. Well, can't do much now that I'm back here, I guess. You're such a psycho. I don't know if you're just a delinquent or whatever, but I've never liked thugs like you. Oh, yeah? Y yeah, guess I should have figured. <laughs> no goddamn way. Maybe you should just like tackle her and then like <laughs> force her to not get on the train. I don't know. Uh, do anybody else have any better ideas? Um, okay, so I need to unseal 10 mystery files for the next part of her. Only have nine. Okay, so my choices are uh, make uh, me Yakushiji or. Oh! Nice. And I'm gonna be rough. God, I hate doing all these like separately, but okay, okay. I'm gonna do his first, and whichever one feels the most natural after doing his, I'll do that one. Alright. Alright. Nenji Ogata again. Alright. When you put it like that, maybe you've got a point. I should slow down and think a little. Still though. Hey, are you even listening? Uh, I'm back. It's happening all over again. Who even is that voice? How'd I end up in this mess? Where the hell was I? It was like... I don't know. I feel like I saw it on some UFO show. Like an alien lab or something. It looked just like that. I was... butt naked too. Yep, that's how most wet dreams go. So Kisaragi always gets on that in the train. All that's what, all this stuff about how I've no idea what the hell he's talking about, but I gotta find a way out of this cr right now. Hey, Kisaragi, you don't have some kind of key handy, right? What does that even mean? I have the key to my house. Is this it? Nah, probably not. I mean, hell, even I've got some house keys. We gotta do something! The kaiju are coming! What? Really? Where? I mean, like, not yet. They get here after we get on this train. How do you know that? Because I saw it. Uh... Shit, how do I explain? You're acting kind of weird. Yeah, it's really getting to me. I'm already sick of all this shit, but what can I do? Just, like, hold her down, I don't know. Okay, let's fight those guys again. Where are you going? Great. What? Hey, you guys got this key thing? What key? What the hell are you talking about? I don't know, man. Just whatever keys you got. I, I had my motorcycle key. <laughs> He's like, what the my fuck? Took it away. Oh, poor guy. Who freaking who? 
you got a ch Oh, yeah. Do you think this is funny? No time for this crap. How about we talk this out? How about screw you? Hey! Come on, you're fighting again? Stop that. Hey, stay out of this, idiot. What do we got? You'd think that wouldn't get to me anymore. But hey, I'm still mad. All right, now search their things. Maybe they have the dick code. Not again. The trains are. I'm gonna go. Hey, hold it! I mean, just hang on a sec. I really need you to stay off that train. Okay, seriously, what's going on? I don't even know how to describe it. Just it's. It'll be really bad. Look. Coming. This train's gonna get derailed. It's gonna be a huge accident, okay? Uh, okay, whatever. My train's about to leave. I'm being serious here. You can talk shit on me if you want, but believe me, just this once. Please. Don't get on that train. <sighs> so, what do I do instead? Let's just get out of the station. We gotta get out of here while there's still time. If we can just get outside this place, that's gotta change something. Oh, hey. See, being honest gets through. Come on, this way. What's wrong? I'm sorry, my ankle hurts. Where? Let me see. Probably a sprain. Get down. I might use that as my thumbnail. Let's go. Man, look at them. How are there so many? They destroyed my home. And they'll destroy 1985, too. We can't beat ourselves up over shit we can't change. Maybe there's no way out of this, but we'll never know if we don't run. Man, Sweet. Come on. Man. We gotta keep going. Maybe I shouldn't have done Ogata yet. I'm really confused <laughs> what time this is happening. Is this after they got sent to the future? Because they didn't know each other before that, right? Kisaragi! Damn it. I'm back here. They showed up in the middle of the city. I couldn't make it out in time. Did you find the key? I don't give a shit about your key. <sighs> Who the hell are you? If you can do all this crazy time crap, then, then save Kisaragi. Tell me Kisaragi. If you want to see her, you need to cooperate with me. I need you to find that key. If you give me its location, then I'll help her. The, the truth? Yes. Still, even if I was lying, <laughs> True. you have a lucky choice. All you can do is trust me, so find that key, and I'll see what I can do. Fine. Sure. Okay, so I should do something differently. Uh, so something before the train comes? I. I. Um, there's another hint. Oh, hey. Isn't that... I feel like I know that guy she's with. Who is he? Why are you being all sneaky? I, I don't know. No reason. Wait, that's Iori over there. <sighs> what, are you hiding from Iori? That's not it. What? Don't tell me you like Iori. Hey, it's not like that. <laughs> <gasps> Dang, the whole squad is just coming Isn't in. That... Karabe? Talking to you here. <sighs> Stop dodging the question. I want a real answer. For real, it's not like that. Hey, I'm still talking. <sighs> then what is it like? What do you care? You're not my girlfriend. Why are you even getting so worked up? <sighs> it's not a big deal. I was just curious. Sheesh. Fancy meeting you here. Kisaragi's hanging around. Kind of hard to talk to Furusaka like this. Where are you going with Oka? 
I'll talk to Juro instead. I know I saw Karabe around here. I must have gone somewhere. No. Try it or you think I'd run from you. No. Huh? Come on, you're you trying to scold. Well, if you didn't keep pissing me, dirt. damn it, I think I fucked up. No. Damn it. Can't just leave her. Oh shit. Okay, 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 okay. We have to not talk to the bullies. There, don't go there. The bullies are there. What the fuck? What's this key? What the hell do I even? What do I do? None of this shit. Tell me about it. The bullies are still over there, right? Nope, nope, nope. Oh shit, I don't know what to do. Hey! Right, this isn't the trick. Go, I guess nothing else I can do. Okay, well that's different. That's weird. I know they got on. <gasps> What's wrong? Is that Are you looking for someone? Miura's sister? Chihiro or something? Sure am, kid. You see a couple school kids uh, about my age? What the fuck? Couple school kids? What the hell? Was that like Magic? Nah. The hell am I? What the? F <laughs> what? The what? Oh, Gata kun Did you? Huh? Okay, look. I know this seems real sketchy. I mean, heck, I'm the guy who chased you onto a train here. But there's something I gotta know. Do you have some kind of key on you? I mean, not like a regular house key. It's supposed to be kind of. <sighs> Yeah, this still sounds pretty damn weird, huh? Hey! Hmm. Very mysterious. Hey, hold on. Why? Why are you looking for something like that? 
Good question. Man, I don't know how I'd even explain it. You're looking for the key? <gasps> You're the one who originally carried it, young man. The school nurse? Wait, I was just talking to Fuyusaka. Wait, wait. Yuri is also the little sister? What the fuck? <laughs> Yuri's just literally every your Yuri, your Yuri, your Yuri. Any more Yuris I have to know about? <laughs> Wait a sec. Are you Fuyusaka or? Wait. I know you. The League of Darkness. What? I remember now. You're one of the bad guys. This will only hurt for a moment. League of Darkness. Age seven. Playing this late? Should you be out here alone, young man? I'm not playing. I'm training. Say, you must be Nenji Ogata kun, right? How about I walk you back to your house? Uh, you're fishy, lady. You talk like the League of Darkness people. They say all that same stuff when they kidnap kids. The League of Darkness? The bad guys from Common Hero, duh. Right, kids and their TV. But you know, I think you're the real bad guy here. Eight years from now, you're going to call a bunch of monsters and destroy the world. Am not? I'd never turn to the side of evil. You're still going to do it whether you're good or evil. Sometimes, things just happen. Uh... You can't trick me. I'm not Hold gonna it. get kidnapped. Little punk. Holy you shit. Just... <laughs> you just fucking shoot kids. That was close. I guess I just did a big lap around the block. What do I do? She even had a gun. She tried to shoot me. She really is from the League of Darkness. I gotta tell the police. Don't move. You're a bad boy. Am I gonna die? It'll only hurt for a moment. I've just implanted you with nano machines. It'll add onto the program inside you. It's not a huge change, but it's something we'll need to fight back. And now, we can prepare our weapons. The Sentinels. Hmm. Man, that stinks. Uh, didn't I just get shot? Did you find the key? Okay. I still don't know what's going on here. But getting shot made me remember something. She shot me back when I was a kid, too. You were shot. I'm going to need you to explain the situation. I was on the train, and the nurse from my school shot me. There were even other passengers around, too. No, wait. That was definitely Fuyusaka. She was all grown up, but I know that was her. Wait a moment. Slow down. You're talking about trains. Where is this happening? It's the place you keep sending me back to. The train platform. And this happened when I chased Fuyusaka onto our train. Hmm. So you're looking for the key on a train platform? Well, yeah. Wait, you mean you don't even know where you keep sending me back to? Okay, I see. That means the person with the key is somewhere around there. You just keep looking. When do I get the explanation? No, 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 no. Uh, okay. Okay, so the last part has to do with the Karabe, um, Juro Karabe disappearing somewhere. Uh, oh! Nice. Juro. No? Yo. So, that League of Darkness version of you, that... Okay, what's your connection to that black cat suit lady? League of... what are you talking about? Damn it, I sound like a total loon. What are you doing? Usami-chan, you trying to pick on Iori now? Please, Kisaragi, just relax for a sec. What? I'm begging you. I mean, the key. You told me something like, I used to carry this key. Ogata-kun, I'm really not sure I follow. Ah, damn it. I gotta figure out how to say this right. Okay, so you haven't said it yet. 
You know what I'm saying. I just want to know. I really don't know. Man, this shit's so hard. For you, Saka. Um, what do you mean? Anyway, I mean, it was some... Uh... You know, when she said I... The me? Come on. Uh, come on. Isn't that enough? Food. The trains leave. Let's go. I'm not done with you yet. Why did I think for you not seeing things right now? Jura. Damn it. Hey, you don't look so Sir, you're being real. Hey! Hey, it's Shinonome Senpai. You're here too? Shinonome Senpai. Mm. Senpai. Though I guess it's not really a mm. man. A... The D key. A key? Yeah. Uh, shouldn't we call someone like who? Like a station worker? Uh, waste of time. Why is that? It's just gonna throw us back to the beginning. Hey, what's going on with you? Senpai. Are you okay? I have to go. Not until you give me that key, bitch. That she said something. She said, it, but none of them can't figure. No. Okay, I'm gonna follow you. Something's up. Do I go after? Yes. Hey, that's the Psych. That's the wrong train. Is this the other other path? Huh? Then what's what was the thing about Juro? Uh, I go this way. Stop. Oh! <gasps> hey, what happened? The fuck? Seki Gahara, why are you here? She don't know my senpai. Are you okay? Must have been her symptoms again. Looks like she passed out. This guy too. I know him. It's Seki Gahara. From back in the ruined city. Why is he with her? Why are they both knocked out? Oh shit, so this is after the Kisaragi story. Okay, okay, uh oh. Something in his hand. DD426. There's some kind of medicine? Label's not telling me much. That's poison. It was meant to poison the D forces. They ended up as collateral damage. What are you talking about, old man? It sounds like you know about Shinonome kun's condition, so you should already understand the symptoms she endures come from that poison. Their nano machines are infected, they're beyond saving. But even with all their sacrifices, they cannot stop the D forces' attack. You keep talking about these D guys. That's all the big mecha kaiju, right? A living apocalypse born in our future, crossing time to destroy it. It all comes down to 15 teenagers, the commanders of the D forces. Ninji Ogatakun, it is a curse, one we cannot escape. Where's all this weird sh Kui? It doesn't matter anymore, but it was never the kaiju, the problem. The true blot on it's us. Mankind was the cancer all along. Here we go. Let's die together, old man. So it was like what? DD146? DD426. Oh, hey, it's I know that guy. He Okino. Um, I guess I'm done with Ogata then. I did all three of the paths. 
Yo! Ah, I really want to finish hers first. God, this is getting so big. Um, okay, um... I'm gonna look at... Okay, so that's done. Fuck, oh, dude, do I not have... Oh, shit. I don't definitely don't have any points right yet. Well, shit, I want to see... Okay, fine, I'm gonna do something completely different then. Either her, or her, or Megumi. Mm, who has the lowest... I guess that's it's Shijimi Jimmy Niyama. I kind of want to do stuff that are relevant to each other first. I like these two stories. Um, what time is it? 30 minutes? Uh. No, I'll continue with Yuki. Cool. Cool. Yuki Takamiya. Wait, I don't have the front gate thing. So many. You know what? Never mind. Um, I'll do Megumi. Get her over with. Megumi Yakushiji. I'm back. I guess Juro hasn't come home yet. Fluffy isn't here either. I should get dinner ready. You were a secret. Bob Abba the third, Shimada coming in to pinch hit. He's closing in on a thousand hits. This could be it. An up and coming star to keep an eye on. Ooh. Miyuki Inaba John. Inaba. She's really taken Japan by storm. So it should come as no surprise that she's in this week's top ten rankings. I think we have. I think you're- I'll grill some ra- And done. I'm home. Wow. What a feast. Miracle. Did you make all of this? Amazing. We'll eat once Juro gets back. Why don't you go wash up while we wait? Right. Tell me your secret. Mm. Sounds like you're pretty hungry. It's okay. I will wait. Well, it seems like Juro is going to be late. Go ahead and eat before it gets cold. No, I could never. Please, I insist. Go ahead. Uh, are you sure? But what about you, Megumi-san? Don't worry. I'll eat with Juro. I see. In that case, I'll do as you suggest. Dog. Thank you for always preparing our meals. It was as delicious as ever. Oh, th Can I help you with anything? That's okay. I've already put away the cutting board and everything. Why don't you go watch some TV and relax? TV? That's better. Hmm. You know, Miyura-kun, you don't have to wear your hat in the house. The surgical scar on your forehead doesn't bother me. How did you know this scar was from surgery? Did I tell you? Oh, oh, well... It, um... Just a lucky guess. I see. Hmm... I guess I found the secret. Yay! Uh, wait, oh. Oh, okay. Oh, it all happened right here. And that's that. Geitaro Miura is a witch. You can't overlook him just because he lives here. But Juro could be home any minute. Does it have to be now? Yes, right now. 
All right. Come here and get now shot, kiddo. The, next headline. the video store explosion that occurred today in Kayakicho. An investigation found that the accident was the result of a gas leak. This is what happened before. Where's my gun? Let me shoot you. Don't come oh, hurry up and shoot him right in the forehead. Oh. In the forehead? Miracle, you always wear your hat. Even when you eat. Megumi-san? Why is that? It's because I have a scar on my forehead. I thought it might be unpleasant. Oh, you don't have to worry about that. That scar, it allows you to pilot a sentinel. Isn't that right? How do you know about that? You want to know how? I'll tell you. But can you show me your... <laughs> I'm sorry, but I have no choice. Why would you say something this before you hurt, shoot? But you'll soon forget. Just shoot and then explain. I'm sorry, Miracun. Don't touch him. He's dangerous. <clears throat> Just as I thought. He's had surgery. There's a component embedded in his forehead. It forces them to use their magic. Who would do such a thing? Humans, obviously. There's many that greatly covet this power. But it's not entirely bad. That component gave him immunity to the curse. This is a good catch. The curse? Yes. He is able to use magic and not suffer the same fate as Juro. <gasps> All right, you see him. It won't be long before he wake. I'd get out of here if I were you. A curse, huh? On the gas explosion and the administration claims these explosions are big gas companies have been and instructed to be gas something. I'm home. Huh? Juro. Mirakun. Welcome back. Dinner's on the table for you. It's fine. I'm not hungry, actually. Come on. I'm sure you'll. Why do you care about me so much anyway? Oh, is that bad? <sighs> Just quit treating me like a child. Mirakun? What's wrong? I'm sorry, but there's somewhere I need to go. I won't be long. A gas explosion? I need to see for myself. Do you know? Oh. Fluffy. You failed to shoot a Sekigahara. You're going too damn slow. All right, sorry. Why were you taking so long in there anyways? Striking stupid poses with your gun doesn't accomplish anything. When it comes to things like this, you need to do the deed quick. Quickly, you got that? <sighs> I'm sorry I didn't catch that. Got it. Well, nothing that can be done about it now, but you better not screw up this time. This time? Shu Amiguchi. The floppy haired dogs oh, that hangs around Juro. The but to shoot Amiguchi. <laughs> you should still have some bullets left. Seal his powers tomorrow. Think you can handle that? <laughs> I'll get it done. Can we like just not do this storyline? No. Hmm. Are you what? Fine. Oh. Hey. Yo. Good morning, Amiguchi-kun. Morning. Did you leave your motorcycle huh? nearby again? What's up? What do you want? Oh, I'm not here to talk to you, Kurabi-kun. It's you I'd like to see, Amiguchi-kun. Me? You're from 1C, aren't you? I am. My name is Megumi Yakushiji. Cool. So what can I do for you? Well, I don't really want to talk about it here. Could we meet somewhere later? Just the two of us? Whoa. Oh, 
I see. How about after school? Let's say the roof of the new building. The roof? Yep. I'll be waiting. It's hard being so popular. Oh, you mad now, Jiro? Bother you? No. Bye. I see. Ah. Uh, sucks when the girl who's obsessed with you isn't so obsessed with you anymore. Fluffy. I know what you're going to say. Do the deed. I won't fail. Ugh. You better not. Whoa, 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 you did you hear something? What was her name? Uh, Miwako. God, there's way too many characters in this game. I cannot remember all of these names. Save my life. So where's the new building? <laughs> I can just go home. Oh. I wonder if he's already on the roof. Megumi, it's not even guaranteed that this cat can magically restore Jiro's memories. Like, why are you doing all this for him? Like, you don't even know what you're doing to these people. Like, like you're just shooting this random gun that a talking cat gave you? Just got shit on my mind. What about you? You look like hell. Like, come on, Megumi. You're so stupid. You yeah, you could say that. Let me just keep eavesdropping on the two best boys. No? Are we done? Okay. Oh, I totally forgot. What's happening? Oh, this is Yakushiji san from 1C. She stopped me this morning, told me she had something to talk to me about. Sheesh. Sometimes you're real annoying to be friends with. Oh, they're friends? I'll just get out of your way then. No, 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 stay here. Come on, Ogata. I want you to watch me shoot. Okay. Again? Oh, just stuff from middle school. Girls used to confess their love to me in front of him all the time. Oh, oh, wow. Is that what this is about? I'm sorry. Re but I've got feelings for someone else. That's not what I came here to tell you. Oh, sorry. Awkward. So, <laughs> what do you need? I need you to die. I guess I sorry about that. Well, what is it then? I need to apologize. This might hurt a little. Anyway. Stop talking before you shoot. Mission accomplished. Sentinel number 20 transmitting. <gasps> oh shit. Amiguchi ain't going down like some bitch. I mean, which is Sentinel was like, nah, uh, uh, I ain't getting shot by some terrible, terrible fucking character. Nah, 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 nah. A robot. No way. Juro. What did you, um. You. You shot Amikuchi-kun with a gun, and then a giant robot appeared. You saw everything? But why did you. Where did it fly off to? I don't know. That's a really big robot to just miss. Like, seriously? How did you not see it go? What the hell did you do this time? Fluffy. I did what you told me to do. You must have come into contact with Miura too. Damn it. How irritating. Juro, he... He saw me do it. I'll take care of it. What are you still doing here? I need to manipulate his memory and make him forget everything he saw. You think I can do that with you hanging around? Take a hint and scram! <gasps> Gosh, Megumi, do you have any, like... <sighs> okay. Okay, so I get that they were, like, deeply in love or whatever, but, like, one, he doesn't remember you. 
two, you're shooting all these people with this mysterious gun you got from a talking cat, and you don't even know what it does to people, and you're just doing it because the cat promised you that he can fix Jiro's memories, which you don't even know if he can. Like, you could even at least ask him for like, hey, can you at least give me proof that you can do this? You know? Uh, actually, did you do that? I don't know. But still, that's just still... Ugh. God, this is... Oh, Megumi. I want to like you. Hmm. What else could I even do with her? Oh. Um, maybe I could do one more. What time is it? 45 minutes? Well, the thing is, I might have to take a break for a couple episodes soon, because there's, like, people coming over. So I'll try to do a little longer episodes. Um, and... Oh, let's see. So I just did Megumi. So I will either do... No, I'll do Miura. I'll, I'll want to continue Miura's story. Can I do any of these actually? Oh, Natsuno Minami. I'll do that one. Monitoring the Sentinel from Kaede River. I met Natsuno san over at the shrine. She ended up dodging my question. What was she doing there? She attends the same school as Juro kun. At least that's what he told me. Wait, so what happened in this? Okay, so flashback. Shopping this drama Gucci's house. Japan, 40 years. Okay, so like, in the first one, he went, he got sent to the future after the battle. And... And the house was just there out of nowhere. Um, I need to, then I can find... Oh, I've tried. I hope I didn't break it. If there's a mechanical issue, I'd love to take a look at it. But security around the building's been tight lately. Now I can't get too close. I can't just sit here. Actually, that factory at the mountain pass may have survived the air raid. It might still be standing in this era. Sure. Uh, so that's what, what, 16 hours? That's 4 o'clock? 4 p.m.? Oh, it just auto. Ayame Park. This is where the factory used to be. Hmm. Hey, it's Magic Chihiro. Chihiro? Is it really you? What business do you have with my little sister? Who are you? I'm that child's older brother. Is there something you need from her? No, she just looks like a relative of mine. Mm. Let's get going. Shihiro, if she's still alive, she'd be over 40 by now. If she's... We don't have a family burial plot where I'd find her. I have no idea what's happened to her. She's either alive somewhere in this world, or... Chihiro, I'm going to find oh, her back to you. You do that, Miura. You do that. Um... Well, shit. I saw when the war... August of 1945, if that's true. And Japan loses the war in just three months. Hero. In any, I should go talk to Natsuno san. She must know something. Wait, that's it? Wait, I, but I got the Chihiro thing. Do I have two? Huh? Okay, well, let's see what this one does. In it. Sunset, visiting my alma mater in Sakura Ward. Okay, that's still in the same path. Sakura High School. It looks nothing like the school I attended. Hmm. 
Oh, does it just does that just mean I got that key? Keywords currently held. Hmm. Okay. Let me just check if there's anything over here. Okay. Nothing at all. It's still here. It's been renovated, but I do recognize this building. Oh, good for if you. This is the school building. Then over there's where the potato field used to be. Looks like that plot of land got bigger. Potato. I wonder if there's a way in. I guess I just I just follow the path, I guess. Sakura There's High School. No one here. Old building. Do they not use this building? This building was brand new. Now the floorboards creak. The pillars are all scratched up. And really has been 40 years. Hmm. Interesting. <gasps> <coughs> Bro, I just gasped so hard I started coughing. This is where I waited for Takatoshi-san. And where Tamao-san came to see me off. How strange. It almost feels like it was all just a distant dream. All right, enough. This isn't the time to be getting sentimental. This is exactly the time to be getting sentimental. You look lonely as fuck. Get like a, I don't know, go hug somebody. Despite a catastrophic, it seems to have entered a prosperous new era. Almost too prosperous. Yeah, wasn't there a, um... So if I remember correctly from uh, Yakuza Zero, wasn't there like a huge economic boom around this time, and then there was like a huge bubble burst, and then everybody became poor or whatever? Like yeah, like um in 1987 I think Yakuza Zero was, and then they had like a huge everybody just had a shit ton of money. Hmm. I checked the library, but in all of history, not in the U.S. What was? Okay. Um, did I even do anything here? Am I just done? Nothing else? Okay. Oh, hey, it's Worst Girl. Oh, hey, watch for dinner. Thank you again for the bento you gave me. I found a nice spot to eat it by the Kaide River. A bento with meatballs. Quite luxurious. I was very impressed. Oh, they were just regular old meatballs. Nothing special. But I'm glad you liked it. What are you doing out here? Are you looking for someone? I'm trying to find Natsuno-san. Would you happen to know where she is? Minami-san? She should be in the track room. The athletic building's over that way. Want me to go check? No, that's okay. Oh yeah. So for dinner tonight, I think I'll make Hamburg steak. You seem to really like it. You mean that giant ball of meat? A hamburger meat, yeah. It's Jiro's favorite. So try not to come home too late. Aw, you get plus points for that one. Those meatballs they call hamburger. <laughs> burger. I've never had anything so delicious. I want some more burger. This is no time to be distracted by food. I, uh, dude. I don't know. This guy seems so there. sad. Somebody give me a hug. Seriously. Like out of all the characters so far, like Mira just feels like, dude, he really needs a friend or something. Everyone's staring at me. I'm glad I found Natsuno-san, but I don't like all this attention. Hey, you. Who, me? You've been standing there an awfully long time. What are you doing? I'm waiting for Natsuno Minami. Minami? How do you know her? And how old are you? Looks like a middle school uniform to me. No, uh, I'm, uh... Seriously? You guys have to be so nosy. Natsuno-san. Come on, let's go. Yeah. So Minami's got a boyfriend, huh? That's right. Sorry I took a while getting changed. It's fine. I said I'd wait. So whenever you exercise, you all change into outfits that show your legs? That's fascinating. Yes. 
Not so good anyway, for my hormonal body. Showed up at school out of nowhere. Everything okay? Actually. Everything okay? Natsuno-san. Uh, before the war. Natsuno-san. I met you before. Back in 1945. And now here you are. Huh? You must know something about all this. About how I ended up in this era. Please tell me what you know. That's, uh, jeez. How do I put this? <laughs> Look, I can't really talk about it here. Go to your place? There's gotta be a good place. Somewhere with no one around. Ah, this is where that we comes in. go to the building I used back in my time, it seemed to be empty. The old school building? We can go in there? Yes. It was open. Alright. Then we'll talk about it there. It's so weird Let's seeing go. Minami with skirt. It's like you lost like half your identity, girl. I always thought this place would be locked up. We should be good here. I mean you'd be surprised how many things you can just get away with. People just don't care. Like, just going into random places. Ah, that was fun. I used to do a lot of that, like... Like, there was like a football game. And I just go around and climb the fence instead of paying for the ticket up front. <laughs> and stuff like that. Like, they just, nobody cares. Just go around the back or go not in sight of official people. Miyuru-kun, can you keep a secret? Uh, of course. Okay. <laughs> then I'll tell you. Don't freak out, okay? This is BJ. He's an alien from the future. You gonna tell me about BJ? <sighs> BJ's looking for the robot he used to get here, and I'm helping him find it. A robot? Does the word sentinel ring a bell? <laughs> that sentinel from back in 1945 belongs to BJ's alien friend. There are a few of them, too. How does she know about the Sentinel? And did she say it was made by aliens? It's a top-secret military weapon created by Japan. I don't need to tell you this, but those babies are capable of time travel. <sighs> hmm. <laughs> BJ! <laughs> I love Miura. I don't care who's respond. I need it to... But what do I... Do? The circuit should have repaired it, but I can't... So, pretty crazy stuff. This BJ, I have some questions about it. I've heard Shikishima engineers talk about something like this. Isn't this actually a type of scout unit? Shikishima? They don't dabble in alien technology. All they do is make weapons, and BJ is no weapon. But... If he's just a scout unit, explain how he can talk. Don't be a jerk, Miracoon. BJ isn't some kind of robot. This is just a <laughs> Aliens come in all shapes and sizes. Oh man. My guess is the only thing inside You're really close. is BJ's brain. You're really stupid, aren't you, Minami? So you're an alien? Interesting. Why are you searching for the Sentinel? What's your objective? To uncover the truth. The truth? Do you wish to know where you came from, do you not? What are you talking about? I came from 1945. Incorrect. Your log proves otherwise. My log? Yeah, show us. Wait. This log. If you really have it, I'd like to see it. Maybe they're all from 2100. Professor. I've switched over to a private channel. Professor Takamiya, can you hear me? Is that... Miura-kun? Professor Takamiya. I'm connected now. Thanks, Miura-kun. What the heck? Yuki-chan? Yo. Everything goes smoothly with the shuttle. Yo. I was able to secure a seat thanks to you. Yo. It'll probably be the last shuttle. Bruh. This place will be lost by tomorrow, too. Has the front line advanced that much already? Afraid so. If anything, they're picking up speed. Did Natsuno get out safely? She arrived in Sector 4 about five hours ago. Ah, so she's there with you. 
You know, you two. I never approved of your relationship. <laughs> what? Mom! Mom! My girl. <laughs> you know what the fuck? <laughs> I didn't think you wanted to talk to me anymore. Mom! <laughs> of course I do. I'm sorry about all the trouble with your father. He and I haven't been on good terms since Wait, who the hell's the dad? Amiguchi? It's okay, Mom. I want to be with you. Wait. Minami kind of has that Amiguchi hairstyle. Yuki-chan's my mom? I'm sorry, Professor Takamiya. The shuttle's about to take off. All what right. the shit? I'll see you at Sector 3 in 14 hours. <laughs> we'll be waiting for you at Landing Zone 10. Looking forward to it. The destruction is spreading. It's only a matter of time until the surface is lost. God, I really want to use that use a picture of her as a thumbnail and say make the title <laughs> Zooey Mama. <laughs> I really, really want to. That was just a segment of the log I've retained. I have to know. When was that log recorded? In the year 2188. That doesn't make sense. How is this even possible? Yuki-chan's my mom in the future? Hmm. Yeah, that is quite the mystery. Alright, one uh, one o'clock. I mean, not one o'clock, one hour mark. Uh, can I even do the other ones? Let's see. Nas no Minami. Yeah, right? I, I have the thing. I really want to go along with this. I, I'm doing extra episodes anyway. I mean, long episodes. May 1985, clears for guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh, uh huh, as always. That scout unit is an alien from the future. At least that's what Natsuno san says. The footage he showed us is allegedly from the future. If it's real, then how am I still alive 200 years from now? All I know for certain is that it's no ordinary scout unit. She's from 19... She seems to know about the existence of other sentinels. Is that how she's able to travel through time? Maybe there's another way. In any case, she appears to be a central figure in all this. Could she still be at school? Uh... Sure. You again. Yep. Minami isn't here today. Must have been really important. She even ditched practice. Is that so? Hey! Are you Minami-san's boyfriend? How far have you two gone? What? No. You've got it all wrong. Do you happen to know where she went? All she <gasps> said was that she was in a hurry. But I don't know where she went. I know where. She went over to Tokyo. What's she doing there? Not sure. I didn't ask. Hey, Ryoko. You jealous? Hey. I know you're there. Toki suck. That's where I. But it was back in my own era. Wait, what the fuck? Uh, Ryoko? I swear she was just here. Did she literally just teleport? Ah, uh, to be a ladies' Toki man, making girls shy, teleport huh? away in embarrassment. That's where I first met her. But it. Okay, I'll go. No, oh, did, did you see that? She just popped out again. Amazing. The shrine's hardly changed at all. The surrounding thicket, on the other hand, that has changed considerably. I don't see Natsuno-san anywhere. I wonder if she's hiding behind the trees again. What I'd give to see that. Oh! <gasps> Couldn't find it. I wonder where it could be. Natsuno san. You guys should really be more careful when you time travel back. Well, hey, uh, what are you doing out so late? And why are you here of all places? Natsuno san, what was that just now? There was a big flash of light, and you just. 
appeared. Just like when I came to this era and my sentinel. Same flash of light and everything. I, uh... Come to think of it, this happened at the shrine back when we first met, too. There was a similar flash, almost like lightning. I get it now. You have to come here to travel through time. What do we do, BJ? Please, tell me what's going on. I just want to go home. Are you just going to leave your sentinel behind? Oh yeah, that's how you got here. What are you going to do with it? <laughs> your debt's... you definitely... Oh, that's about Shihiro? I'll figure out how to deal with the sentinel later. It's Shihiro. My little sister. If there's any chance she made it out of that hell alive, then I have to find out. Hmm. Okay, that makes sense. BJ, think you can make it happen? Come on, BJ. Come on, BJ. Please. Oh, God, look at how much shit he has. Fine. Activate gate. Setting coordinates to sector 5. Oh, hey, follow me all the way here. So it was with Natsuno Minami all this time. What what exactly are you? I kinda wanna do your prologue next just to see what the hell is wrong. Like what what is up with this girl? She's just everywhere and knows everything. Are we back? Bye! Okay. Is it really that easy to travel through time? <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? If we have the power to travel freely through time, can I just send the Sentinel back to before the war starts? Nope, that's impossible. We can't just jump around as far as we want. We can only travel 40 years at a time. Oh, that's Besides, news. Besides, this is as far back in the past as we can go. I see. That's unfortunate. For now, let's find Shihiro. Alright, let's go. Oh, look at these cuties. She's most likely at an evacuation shelter. If not, then I might find her at the Karabe's house. Move out! <laughs> What's going on? The place is deserted. The factory and station are both empty. Radios are down. No one's answering. Where is everyone? You see that? It's that creature. Okay, so that thing is an alien weapon, and it's here to invade Earth. The Sentinels were created to fight them off. This is just like what happened in the city from the future. After the aliens invaded, everyone was gone. Wait, if people are disappearing in the past, what's happening to everyone in my era? <sighs> Well, your guess is as good as mine. That's <gasps> Tamoe! Tamao-san! Oh, Tamao. What happened? Title signs are failing. Condition is too critical for life support. Tamao-san, where's Chihiro? Chihiro, John. She's about to die and you're asking about your sister? Come on. At least show her some respect. <gasps> she got taken by Goto? Goto-san, what are you doing? Let me go! Please calm down, Miss Morimura. Yeah. Chihiro-chan! Wait, what? Where do you plan on taking her? Yeah. I apologize for what I've done to you. But you have no reason to worry. Wait. Bro, what? Go no, to no. what? The one who was giving you medicine. Uh. Tamaho san! Huh? She disappeared. Was she an android? Does that mean the aliens got her? Probably. It's likely that everyone is being held there until this world 
Okay, I, I'm starting to want some answers. What the hell is going on? Seriously? People just disappear? That happened in the future too, right? Like the, um, the Kisaragi's people in that time period, they all just disappeared, but they didn't because they're special or whatever. I don't know. What the... What? What the shit? Oh. Oh, shit. We got Goto's story now. Can we even do all the other, other things? Man. Okay, next time I'll try to do as much more Miura as possible and then... Oh god, dude, what the fuck? And then maybe do... What, what, what was her stuff? Um, Sakura High School, Inventory Secret Facility, Tokyo Saka Shrine... Um, I don't know, I'll figure it out. God damn, dude! Goto seems like the biggest evil right now. Yeah, 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 you! Right. I'm sure we'll see eventually. God. I really don't know what order I should be doing these in. Because it feels like once I go too far in one, I forget about the stuff in the others. And then if I do, the, like, I don't know. Right, anyways. I'll do. I'll stop here. Uh, yeah. Uh, later.